Hello everybody, nice to see you again, good to be back, despite having a small cold, which is simply boring, that's all, but anyway, tech problems, too complicated to really go into, but when I last spoke, the computer had decided to um, free up some space, and it had got rid of some things, and one of those things made the icons of any photograph or film that I had taken appear as blank. Eventually, they appeared as a strange splat with uh, an anxious looking cartoon cat running away from the splat um, and it meant I just I put a lot of stuff in uh, just about everything in files obviously but all the new stuff I hadn't put in files because that's what I was doing at the pre precise moment that the stupid computer decided it knew better and I had done a whole bunch of stuff. So, chronology's going to go well out the window in the near future, along with any planning, synchronisation, whatever. Meanwhile, eventually that was getting solved when the computer then decided to upgrade want of a better word. I never find upgrades of benefit at all. I'm happy with what I've got, that's why I got it. Uh, anyway, and that shut everything down and then the taskbar at the bottom, you know, this here, I'm on a different computer by the way, the taskbar at the bottom, when I clicked on like uh, open a web page or when I clicked on the photo file just wouldn't open which was no good to man or beast and that took days to sort out and then and it took somebody who knows about things as well who very kindly told me about it in the shop and didn't charge anything um, that's Collie Dog uh, Collie Dog Computers in Rothbury a really nice fella there and very helpful and very friendly and then Having done that, I managed to get those to open. When I opened the files with the pictures in, which hadn't quite been sorted yet, this upgrade had jumbled them all up and changed their dates. And even with some, had got rid of the concept of a file and just distributed the photographs all over the place and films. So, given that I've got something like 3,000 and something, uh, that's been taking a long time. So we haven't actually cured any of that. Instead, what I'm doing is I'm shoveling all this stuff onto an older computer, which hasn't got anything on it, uh, in the hope that as I do that, I can rationalise things. It is going to be a long time until we're back on track, but for now we have all of this kind of stuff. Thank you for your patience. Thank you for your patience with this, because we're on 3 minutes 26 seconds already. The computer's going to go to sleep. But coming up, at least I can say we've got that. So what I'm, what you will get in the near future is um, anything I have put onto the camera since the catastrophe, which obviously I can download onto the old computer and start afresh from there. So I guarantee we are going to get that strange night and sh and probably one or two other little oddities, really strange stuff, while I do the Brewster Buffalo and then uh, we'll start. Hopefully by then things will start to come back together. How about that? What... Uh, Computers, you do not know better, or at least you do not know what's going on in my mind, because nobody else does either, including me. So, don't get shirty. Anyway, I'll leave you with one little thing that I noticed the other day while everything was going wrong. So, uh, on the old computer, I managed to get back on the t onto the internet, and I saw something fantastic, and I hope you enjoy it. I know it's uh, meant for educational purposes, but you know, you 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 know. Just roll with it. So thanks for your patience. See you soon. Bye-bye.
Ladies and gentlemen, I bring to you from the geniuses around the decision-making boardroom of Atlantis Model Company, the Amoeba. I was blundering through eBay when I found this extraordinary thing. Uh, I found it a little while ago, but it took a long time to stop laughing. This is this is some kind of model model kit measures fourteen by seven by three. Um, well, this might be the weirdest. Oh, I mean, there's some weird stuff out there, isn't there? This might be the most unanticipatable model um, I've ever encountered uh, sadly it's, it's not going cheap enough <laughs> like 30p I shouldn't mock this is probably a masterpiece and it's probably fantastic for education and so on but just like <laughs> oh heavens what an oddity what a remarkable, remarkable thing. So, if I see it at a reasonable price one day, I will snap it up. Uh, pardon my intrusion. I'll let you go now. Thanks for watching. Bye. 35 quid if you're wondering. There you go. Um, yeah. Thanks for watching. See ya.